ETLR Radio, your fashion, your lifestyle, your music, you're plugged in. We're fed and got the juice live from the broadcast brunch. Yes, in LA Live. It is going down. And I'm on the West Coast. Yeah. So I'm got to tap in with that real West Coast energy. This man was on the stage. When Kendrick said Kendrick and Friends, he was ta- he was one of the friends. He was on that stage. Ray Vaughn is here, baby. What's Talk happening? to me. What's the deal? How's everything? It's hot. It, yeah, it is. It it's is. hot outside. It's hot outside. It's hungry outside. It's, it's hungry. energy outside. Listen, y'all got y'all have some major energy right now in this West Coast. Yeah. Um, how do you feel about that? You know, what I mean, being, being the lyricist you are. I love it. I feel like I feel like we this nigga Dot just came and shifted the culture again. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, all right, let's let's capitalize off this momentum and this energy that we got going on. You know what I'm saying? You see people like Roddy dropping fire. You know what I'm saying? YG dropping fire like. The whoops dropping fire, uh-huh. shit that's gone. So, what did it, this whole moment, right? What did it really mean to Ray Vaughn, man? To me, shit, I was the only artist that wasn't Black Hippie with TDE yep. up on that stage. So, I was Damn. I was grateful of that. Number one. Number two, I was grateful for being the only Long Beach artist up there as well. So, to me, that meant everything. And I'm sharing the stage with a big dog, you feel me? So, that's like my fucking, that's alumni to me. Real. I'm rookie, you know what I'm Real. saying? Like, it's my freshman year. So. Now listen, y'all. I saw him yesterday, right, moving around, and I had to give him his flowers. Because if y'all don't know, Ray Vaughn, Pen Game is sick. Pen Game is sick. He just dropped the record with him and Pusha T. Yeah. How did you and Pusha get together on this record? So overall, like I was recording his record problems, top walk in, like, man, you know who'll be crazy on this? I'm like, who? Billy Eilish? He like, no, nigga. <laughs> I, I like Pusha. I'm like, that would be crazy. Like. Three weeks later, he, like, called me to the studio, got his little sneaky camera phone up, and he, like, press play, and he pressed play and pushed on that bitch. And he gave me a Coke bar. What are we talking about? Hey, gave you, man, and he gave you some gems in it. Yeah, he, he definitely gave me gems. He gave you some gems you in it. You feel that. me? I like that. that, that, that be was, clear of your peers. Hey, be Cause clear. Because in a couple of years, it'd be musical chairs. Hey, listen. You know what he, I'm saying? Listen, Push is one of our legends, you know what I mean? One of our goats. Pen game is always super amazing. Fire. Uh, now... Who did you really come up listening to? I know Kendrick, but who else though? Uh, Fifty Cent, uh, Fabulous, Wheezy, um, Jada Kiss, Meek Mill, uh. Future, okay, and Sade. <clears throat> Shot A, man. I know it's random. Man. You feel me? But I, I fuck look, with look, listen, we, we, we got to do that sometimes as well. Yeah. Listen, y'all, I told him yesterday when I seen him, I, I, I was complimenting him about a stylist pin game. But I remember when he came to the DMV. And when he came to the DMV, we gave him a pair of the New Balance. We had to get yeah. him right. Yeah. We gave him yeah, a pair. Yeah, yeah, y'all put me on. And y'all was ahead of the time, though, because I was like 20, 21. Yeah. Now everybody rocking New Balances. And Roger, he said that he had the nerve to say to me, he said, I was just out there. I said, when was you in the DMV? I was just there. And you know, me and Isaiah Rashad, but that was two years ago. No, no, no. But then I was just, I just left off tour. Again? I just got off tour. And June, I was in, in the DMV. Oh, shoot. All yeah. right, so I missed him. I didn't mess him. I, I did. I did mess him because you that you and Isaiah Rashad show was crazy. Nah, this one was crazier. For I got real? better birth control, better stage present, and I got a full set where I know what I'm doing now. That was me announcing. You know what I'm saying? Give me a crazy tour story. Something crazy that happened with you on tour. It don't matter what it was. Give me a crazy tour story. Crazy tour story. Mmm. I had to kick a shorty out of my room. Um. I had to kick a shorty out of my room. She was in her, uh, she was about to get clapped, and she had on a leotard. <laughs> she had on a leotard with the bottom unbuttoned, and some nigga called, and she answered the phone. And it's her boyfriend, I swear to God. And he like, yo, you about to get clapped? Yo, you dead ass? He was sad, he was sad, the man was sad. The man was so sad. Uh, he like, Which, what hotel you at? Where you at? She was like, I'm in here with Ray. I'm like, oh yeah, you gotta go, you gotta go. So she had to go, not because, you know what I'm saying? She had a man, because that that's her problem, not mine. But the fact that she put me in danger by putting the camera on me. Oh, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? Talking about she finna get clapped by me. Like, that's crazy. That is nuts. I ain't feeling that. Yeah. What was your thoughts on this Double XL freshman cover, right? Now, listen. And before you answer, the cover says, the, the tagline is not like us. 
But then it's not one West Coast artist on there. It said not like us. The covers is the not like us class. Are you? And it's, it's blasphemy. Not, and no, it is not it's blasphemy. One West Coast artist on That's there. That's crazy. How does Rayvon feel about this freshman class that they picked? Um, I didn't. I didn't really. I rock with Double XL, but I feel like the covers or the artists that it been it hasn't been going crazy as it as it is originally known for. Uh -huh. But I feel like it's because the artists ain't you know they don't take it as serious as they should. So I seen like some of the freestyles with no beats, and I was like, what is this trash? You know what I'm saying? Trash. But you know maybe that's where the music is going for them. So I wouldn't do that, but you know the each is on. Like he said, he wouldn't do that because this is a man of morals and integrity right here, and about a real. I'm a, game. I'm a man who who get in a, a big platform, and I'm I create a moment. I'm gonna create a moment, no matter what platform I get. I'm gonna capitalize and make sure I feel like it's your job to discover the talent. If you double XL, it's my job to to uh, display my talent. If I'm picked, there's, there's some stuff like that. You know what I mean? Yo, last last question before I let you go. When yeah. when is the project coming? You know this nigga top don't be telling niggas dates. Y'all niggas don't get no dates. Not just playing. This uh, I hope. Look, this me, this me, this me. People, people want a project. I want momentum. I agree. I don't want to be the nigga who dropped the project and it get a couple thousand streams and nigga go turn it back up to whatever they was listening to because I didn't make no real emotion with it. You want some real impact. When you look at like who, new artists, we don't have a lot of new artists that stuck in a album stuck. One artist that album stuck, Tyler. Tyler album stuck because Water was a big record Hill. and it went with it. You know what I'm talking about? We don't have that. Follow up. Niggas yeah. just trying to drop music and just do whatever the fuck they want to do and then label. Now you owe the label. I don't want that. I want. I want to make sure that when I drop a record and it boom, then we get going. That's what I'm on. Listen, you're in good hands. That TDE factory is real. Uh, TDE in good that hands. TDE yeah, is in good. That's how you talk. Hey, Big B. Big B is my dog. I, yeah, I gotta, Big B the chef. I, I, I got I to gotta hit him while I'm out here. He's going to kill me, actually, when he see all this anyway. Cause that's usually when I land from the, from, since I started coming out here, I hit him when I get here. Hey, I'm here. And he makes sure I'm good, man. So, listen, Ray Vaughn, let the people know where to follow you at, Ray. Shit, you can follow me at Ray Vaughn everywhere. Instagrams, Twitters, all that. B-A-U-G-H-N, not O-N, you hear me? Listen, you hear Ray Vaughn is here. TD is in the building. We on the West Coast, man. Fathom got the juice. Stay plugged in. DTLR Radio, let's go.